If you have been using ChatGPT quite extensively for the past few minutes or hours, a error message saying too many requests in one hour may show up. Once this error message shows up, you won't be able to execute any new commands or use ChatGPT until the message goes away. Well, if you can't wait till the limit goes away, here are a few workarounds to fix the problem quickly. So the first thing to do is to clear the chat GPT cookies and cache files. So clearing the cache files and cookie files will quickly help you to get rid of this error and start using chat GPT again. To do this, all you need to do is click the three dots icon here and click settings. Select the privacy and security option from the options on the left side. Scroll down and select cookies and other site data. Now scroll down and click on see all site data and permissions. Now use the search options to find the chat GPT website. Just enter open and it will open and show up this chat.openai.com website. So it will show the number of cookies that's currently being stored. Or if you click this uh, carrot icon here, you can see what all are the permission that is in use and other details as well as the cookie usage. So all you need to do is just click this dustbin icon or the delete button. On the pop-up that appears, click on the clear button. Now you may log into your chat GPT account again and start using it without the limit problem. The next method to use chat GPT is to create a new chat GPT account. So just head over to the openai.com website. Click the try button from the top right corner. Since you have already cleared the chat GPT cookie and cache files, you will be automatically logged out of your old account. So wait till the new account or the new website loads up. Once you are in the welcome page, click on the sign up button. Now open a new tab and go to the website called emailfake.com. Copy the temporary email address given there. Enter the email address and click on the I am not a robot button. Complete the CAPTCHA verification. Click on the continue button. Enter a random password and hit continue. Now head back to the emailfake.com website and hit the verify email address on the email that you received just now. Now you need to enter your name. Click continue and now it will ask you to enter your phone number. You can use the same phone number as you used in your previous account as ChatGPT does not uh, have any limit on the number of accounts that you can create on the same phone number. Just enter your phone number here, click on the send code button, uh, verify, do the verification and once everything is done, you may log in to your new account and start using ChatGPT right away. So one thing that I would suggest is that you click on this uh, Chrome profile icon click on the add option and create a new uh, Chrome profile and log in to multiple uh, chat GPT accounts on all these profiles. The last option is to wait for some time and then start using chat GPT again. The number one reason why chat GPT shows the too many request error is that you try to execute many commands in the short span of time. To keep spammers away from the platform, chat GPT has put certain restrictions in place. So all you need to do is wait for an hour or two hours max and the restriction should go away. Then you may open chat GPT and start using it again.